All right, welcome back to another episode of Brass and Beer. This is my very last episode uploaded for the year uh, 2017. Uh, crazy to think about. I have actually uploaded one video, at least one video, every week for the whole entire year. Um, and even some weeks I uploaded two to three. So that's really exciting. Uh, about to hit 100 total videos on the channel. Uh, we're climbing to 300,000 total video views, which is super exciting, guys. I, this is so weird to think about this, but um, I hear so many other YouTubers say, I never thought I would reach this point. I never thought I'd reach this point. And I feel that. I definitely feel that now. It's uh, it's pretty interesting to feel because it's like 300,000 video views. I mean, 300,000 people have seen my videos out there. Uh, it's just crazy to me. I have almost 600 subscribers, which is so awesome. And uh, hopefully we can just keep growing this thing and, and keep doing it big. So uh, with that being said, this is actually my very last <laughs> brass and beer video that I will ever be uploading. So last one. Um, I got I got some some things I need to get taken care of. So uh, until those things I can get taken care of, this is my last video. So with that being said. Uh, there was a few things that I wanted to do. Uh, one of them was I want to read some comments to you guys. So there's some really funny comments on my videos. And uh, I thought I'd just go through them and, and read them real quick here. So uh, we're just going to go through. These are totally random. This is on a really early video. Uh, I see the guy on the right has the uh, right sweatshirt on. Go Ducks. I was wearing a, a, a Ducks sweatshirt. So hey, man, Go Ducks. Uh, did have a bad year this year, but but Go Ducks. Um, this is a, this is one, a funny one, a review video without even touching the rifle. <laughs> and, uh, and I responded, if you want to see us touching the rifle, then watch the shooting video. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, just kind of a funny one there. Um, the, uh, here's another one by Beham Bus. Brass and beer, yet no beer consumed. Well, uh, be ham bus. I got some news for you. I got like a thousand other comments saying brass and beer. Are you kidding me? Alcohol and firearms don't mix. So which one is it people? I just don't get it. Um, this is a good one. The only hiccup that rifle has is the dumbass is doing the review on it, but way to go on reading Ruger's brochure. <laughs> hey man, just a couple dumbasses reading the brochure over here. Uh, Oh, this one's good. Two years ago. It has a front sight with a built in gas block. Are you two kids new to the AR world? Question mark. Actually, uh, vessel of the auditor. I am new to the AR world, so thank you for for pointing that out. I don't know much about them. I've had mine for a couple of years now, but I still know nothing about AR. So I mean, I I could always use to learn more. So thanks for pointing out that I I am new to the AR world. I appreciate that. Um, oh, this was a good one. Uh, we used to say a thing that I used to say at the beginning of the videos was "Welcome back to the man section on YouTube." We scrap that. Yeah, I, got, I know, guys. Come on. It's, yeah, I got gotcha. you. Um, this one, he said, more like the gay pole smoker section of YouTube. That that got me. I thought that was pretty funny. Um, oh, this is a good one. Here you guys. You guys need more years of experience with firearms. Your comments are amateurish at best. Well, I am an amateur when it comes to making gun videos and uh, shooting guns. So... Alcohol-based review, you both look like you need to be carded. No offense. Alcohol plus firearms equals fundamental flaw fail. That was Dirt Road WTF. Dude, what the heck? I got people saying, hey, no beer consumed. And I got other people now saying, fundamental flaw fail? Like, dude, I don't know which one is it. Um, oh, uh, one of my Ruger videos, we, we tossed the AR to get it over to the other person. And it was captured on video. Thought it was kind of cool, just threw it in there. Uh, so, uh, Baldy Locks says, who throws a gun? Stupid. Okay, thanks. Appreciate the uh, the input. I got some more funny funny comments here. Just a, just a few more, not too many. Why the sand color on a black rifle? Well, Bruce Gillett, I like the look of a sand color on a black rifle. So how about that? Oh, right. This is another good one. Same same video. Why would I put that color accessories on a black gun? Again, I like the color. It's all personal preference, buddy. So figure it out here. Oh, this, this is a good one. I, I am not a good shooter by any means. I 
am lucky if I hit the target. So I really, I really enjoyed this one. <laughs> Pretty sure the accuracy was you, bud. You pulled left on both calibers. So yeah, I, you're, you're right. I did pull both left on both calibers. I'm not a good shooter. It's something that I'm working on in every video. And that's why I make these videos. Cause I want to get better and, and, uh, be more comfortable and, and be an expert someday on, on firearms. But right now, I'm an amateur. I'm a, I'm a beginner and I'm just sharing my beginner opinion with other beginners out there. So not only are you shooting with a burn backstop, but you're shooting at the top of the mountain with blue sky backdrop back with a blue sky backdrop. Your bullets are going for miles in all directions, all over the countryside and valley below. Very, very irresponsible. It's just, it's so irresponsible. So apparently DIY solar wind and water green electricity knows my range better than, than I do. So that's fine, but I totally understand where he's coming from. I'm just over here, just firing shots into the blue sky and uh, it's raining bullets out here. So you got to watch out, hide your kids, hide your wife, hide out everyone. Cause it's raining bullets. Um, oh, this, this is actually a good one. <laughs> Back your head up a bit or you're going to get cut boy. <laughs> that's funny. Um, oh, this is a good one. Hitting the target is better than not hitting the target. Thing. yeah that's I'm I'm really glad that he mentioned that because I'm hitting the targets usually better so I if I wouldn't if he wouldn't have said anything I probably would have just kept missing so um oh this is another here 100 yards dude really that was some terrible shooting that's why the camera at the target stopped you probably turned it off ha 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 so uh yeah I don't I show my targets unlike a lot of other gun videos out there uh, I show my misses. I'm not. I'm not ashamed of missing at all. I can vouch for that one. My camera did turn off. So, um, but yeah, if you'd like to see, I'm sure I could find the uh, the cutout there on that one. If I, if you're really that curious to see my misses, so I think I hit probably like three out of ten shots on that one or something. It was a brand new rifle out of the box. But besides the point. So the next thing I have for you guys here is just a, a little video montage, and this is for the um, basically the last however many years I've been doing doing brass and beer I think it actually says here let me see my very first video was uploaded uh, March 17th of 2015 so we're going on three years this March will be three years um, it's it's definitely exciting uh, 277,000 total video views so far and just under 600 subscribers so I'm growing I really want to build this thing into something more uh, but again, unfortunately, this is my last video that I'll be uploading to Brass and Beer. So anyway, so it won't it won't be the uh, the last video I ever upload to YouTube. Um, I do have something in store. Uh, I do need a little bit of a break. So I'll, starting out the new year, I won't be uploading for maybe a month or two. I don't know how long exactly, but my first video will be uploaded sometime within the first couple months of the new year. Um, subscribe so you can see what's going on with the channel because I got some huge changes that are coming and I promise you guys 2018 will be the biggest year of this channel throughout the whole history so throughout the past three years this will be the the biggest change and and the video level is going to go up and subscribe because I promise you it's going to get good from here on out so uh go check out the video montage and uh and uh this is six shooter Tell me, can you see the stars? We're just running forward in the dark. Can you just want my soul needed? Two hearts we share the same beating. Is this what it feels like? Coming back to it, coming, coming, coming.